Hello everyone, my name is Harsh and a very warm welcome to all of you in this AI Assistant app in Flutter and in this video we are going to cover a little bit introduction and basics of GetX in Flutter. So if you don't know what is GetX, GetX is an extra light state management provided in Flutter. So by default Flutter provides set state for state management okay and there are many popular state managements like providers block etc but getx is one of the most simplest of them so we are going to use that in our application so you can just simply search getx flutter and you will get this package called as get and after that if you click on it you can see it is one of the most like package and here are some of the most easiest demonstration that why it is most like package and you can see this easy navigation so we are going to use get for navigation because writing that navigator dot of context and stuff it takes a lot of time and you can see some state management using obx so we will use that and there are something called as controllers concept here so we will also use that and you can see there is some translation feature and theme feature that we require so without wasting much of time if you want you can read this documentation in detail and we will cover some of this stuff as we proceed further so there are two options one is this latest another is this pre-release version actually i am going to go with this stable version uh, it has some bugs or issues that i have found so that's why i'm not using this so simply copy this code snippet and let's move to our VS code and inside this pubspec.yml uh, we can just add this okay so simply like this for state management and simply click on this download symbol and now we will use get for our basic navigation so simply inside this main.dat to use get for navigation we need to change this material app into get material app and we have to import this okay so there are multiple options here uh, we can use this first one okay get material app we don't require much in this screen and we can remove this const if we like and another thing i will love to give a title to it so title and that will be our app name okay so it is shown when your app is in recent tray so simply we have created a variable called as app name and we can import the global and if you just click on it you will see this app name ai assistant okay so so this is all required to use get for the basic navigation now inside this splash screen uh, instead of this all uh, huge stuff what we will do is we will use get navigation so how we can use so we can use get and we need to import get simply get dot and we can call off okay now you might wonder why i'm using off off means it is similar to push replacement which means replace the current screen and then move to the next screen if you use two which means just simply move to the next screen don't remove the last screen so i want to remove the current screen and we can just copy this code snippet from here okay and after that another thing we have to move it like this to parenthesis and after that an arrow operator it is recommended by getting the latest versions and just uncomment this line of code now I can remove an extra parenthesis from here and simply control save okay and now as you can see these three to four lines of code is reduced into hardly two lines of codes and that's why getx is beautiful and now the next thing is our onboarding screen so inside this onboarding screen we already use this navigator stuff so what I'm gonna do is I will just comment this from here and simply I have written get dot off and simply move to the home screen again off because we want to do push replacement rather than just push okay and that's it we did it now if i just press f5 to test the application now as you can see the application is up and running and you can see instance of get material controller has been created and when we create get material app it simply creates get material controller which helps in navigation so it is helping us to move in the screens and for now that's it for the getx as we proceed further we will cover many concepts of getx in this course so that's it for this video see you in the next video till then bye bye